Hi everybody, this is Konstantin Meinfeld, I'm back on YouTube and this is a new harmonica video. Finally, I want to get way more active on this YouTube channel, although I've never really been away from YouTube. Uh, I'll tell you about that later, but first of all, Happy New Year, um, wishing you all the best for 2020. Um, a lot of health and of course great music with this little instrument. Um, so in July 2019 I started to do harmonica live streams. Um, on the Hona YouTube channel. They are called Hona Live and um, I do them bi-weekly on Wednesdays at 9 p.m. Central European time. So if you haven't checked them out already, you should definitely do so. Um, I think the next one will be this week, so you can head over to the Hona YouTube channel and stay updated in our Facebook group, which I'll also link below. Um, we can talk about everything harmonica and music related there and also decide upon future topics for the harmonica live streams. Um, yeah, that's a great thing. We already did 12 of them and I'm looking forward to um, continue the series this year. Um, I want to get way more active here also. So I bought a softbox. There's one. There's another one. Um, to have better lighting and to record videos when it's dark outside, which is the case most of the time, especially now in winter. And um, I still want to get a nice background, so if you have uh, suggestions for that, that would be amazing. Um, just let me know down below in the comments. Um, so this is just a little test video. Um, I have my C harmonica in my hands. Um, this is a C major scale exercise. I think Jason Ritchie has a video online where he calls these exercises drone phrases. Um, so I will start on 4 hole blow playing C, then I'm playing D, playing 4 hole draw, then I'm moving back to C, and then I'm playing E, and it continues. Um, I'm just moving through all the possible jumps um, within the C major scale. So it's C, D, C, E, C, F, C, G, C, A, C, B, and C to C, the octave jump. And then we do the whole thing uh, descending. So um, I try to articulate every single note here with a da. So I'm really talking through the instrument, saying da on the blows, but also on the draws. Um, this is the exercise. And descending. This is actually way harder if you slow it down. Um, but yeah, this is a faster tempo. So yeah, that's a great exercise for getting used to the distance between the holes on the instrument but also a great exercise for articulation. Um, especially in classical music, um, it gets very important to do this. Um, just thinking about phrases like... If I play this without saying da through the instrument on the C major triad in the beginning of the phrase, this is the sound without any articulation at all. So. I prefer the first version, um, but please let me know which one you like better. Um, so yeah, that's it for today already. Um, please let me know if you have uh, future topics in mind which I could cover in these videos here. And um, if you want to stay updated and follow my musical journey and my harmonica journey, I think I'm most active on Instagram. So if you search for Constantine Weinfeld there, um, you can stay in touch. Um, also check out the Facebook group below and I hope to see you soon um, in the next Hona live stream or in the future videos on this channel. Have a good evening or good day wherever you are. Bye bye.